Okay, so as I said, we're going to be viewing some things we had trouble with. So I corrected your text, and I noticed you guys had a couple of mistakes. But first, I want to tell you that the writing was great. Like seriously, I had a lot of fun correcting it. A lot of you used great planning, great strategies. You guys have used the writing process we learned, and I want to congratulate you on that. But there were a couple of things I want to tell you. First, you guys have a lot of spelling mistakes. So I'm going to encourage you to revise your text a little bit more, all right? Then a lot of you used French words, but English words too. L'anglais, if you will. If you're not sure about a word, you look up the dictionary or you just raise your hand, uh, sir, what's, uh, what's this in English? All right, I'm not gonna bite you, okay? Very good. And then, every single one of you, when you're using adjectives to describe something, well, you always seem to put them in the wrong order or in the wrong place of the sentence. It's okay. We never learned adjectives. But I got a little game for you to play. First, I'm going to explain to you. Makes sense. So, adjectives they describe people, animals. Anybody can give me an example of an adjective? Yep. Yep, colors. That's very good. Anyone else? Sarah? Blonde hair. Hmm? Blonde hair. Blonde, yep, that's also cool. Size? Size, size is very good. So they modify grammar pronoun. Usually the adjectives go before the noun. We're going to see the grammar part. I'm just going over really fast. So the blue suit is missing or after a verb. This game is hard, hard modifies game. Hard modified is. <laughs> Sorry, guys. So, anyways, speaking of games, you guys, have, you guys all have your grammar copy books, right? Yeah. yeah. Pretty good. I want you guys to think real hard, real long about three adjectives that can describe this thing. What is this thing, anyways? You're right. It's a big cat. It's a big tiger. So I want you to think of three different adjectives. Write those, write tiger in your grammar copy book, and three adjectives that describe the tiger. Just three adjectives. When you're done, we're going to see if you guys have some good adjectives. So one minute to do that. Okay, time's up. Who can give me what they had? Yep. Strike it. Striped. S-T-R-I-P-E-D. Striped. Yep. Striped means that they're lined, line patterns. Like that. Like she is wearing a striped shirt. You show your shirt real quick? Get up. Get up. She is wearing a striped shirt. We all understand what stripes are? Stripes. So stripe is a good one. Thank you. Another adjective, yep. Black and white, the colors are good. Yep. Is this thing dangerous? Could he eat your face in like one second? Yeah. Very dangerous. Okay, one last one. And it is big. Size, very good. So big, dangerous, striped, or black, white, dangerous, very good. So you all have three adjectives? We all understand what I had to, what we have to do here. We have to find three adjectives, we have to find them. But it was a little bit boring, so I'm going to add some stuff here. On the next picture, you'll have one minute to find an adjective. Then you're going to look at your partner, everybody sitting next to a partner. Yes. Yep, you can work with the girls behind you. Or in front of you, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> It's cool, it's cool. Um, then, you 
will share your adjectives. If you have the same or different, so we're going to think, we're going to pair, and we're going to share. You guys understand? Yes. Very good. You ready? Uh, do you guys see? Do you want to close the lights? We're good? Okay. We're good. <laughs> I will give extra points to anyone who can tell me where this is from. Shillin knows? Where's it from? Shillin is awesome because she knows what it is. <laughs> Anyways, find some adjectives, think about it, and in about one minute, we're going to pair, we're going to discuss it. Time's up. Pair and share, boys and girls. Let's discuss them. Your adjectives that you have. Uh, Try not to use the same ones you use for the tiger and the robot. Also, if you could find a noun for it, it'd be really cool. Yeah, very good. And 
pieces up. Let's pair up and discuss them. Magician. Yeah, some of you had magician. Old man, wizard, weird guy with a stick. <laughs> that would work. All right. So you guys are used to this by now. You ready for the last one? Fair warning. The last one is pretty scary. You sure you're ready? Close lights. One minute to think. Give me three adjectives. <laughs> Give me three adjectives and then we'll pair and talk about it. And remember to only write the adjectives, no need for sentences. Thank you. 
So I googled sea monster and that's what came up. So it was sea monster, but you can use all those nouns. All those nouns are great. Yep. I think it looks like a big green one. A big green one. Adjectives written there. All right? You all see it? Order of adjectives. 
So when I give this to you, you put it in the grammar section of your binder. I need